Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Chris, I'm with Aqua Washes and servicing all of Brentwood, Antioch, Pittsburgh, Discovery Bay, and surrounding areas. And today I'm gonna update you on my detailing business. How long have you been detailing for all the new people you have? Yeah, so I've been detailing uh, seven years now, back in, uh, since March of 2016. Right now I have three employees and three vans. I had four last year, but uh, we're looking into getting into a shop now. So got rid of one. So Chris, quick question. Yeah. What made you want to get employees and more vans? Why not do it yourself? Yeah, once I started getting uh, busier, I knew that I had to get to grow a team pretty much uh, in order for me to grow. I've always wanted to grow to the point where I'm kind of just managing things and stuff like that, like that kind of business owner. Are you there now or are you still working on that? Uh, I'm still working on it, definitely. I think um, I'm very close to getting there, but uh, yeah, pretty soon. So you're one of those detailers that, you know, you're growing a team. But, but what is one of the hardest things about managing all that? Uh, honestly, just ha keeping everything organized, making sure that if someone reschedules last minute or cancels that we have people in the books to, to be able to kind of take their spot. Um, and then also just being uh, very clear with our employees that those things do happen in this business. So making sure they, they're aware of it and then they have to be flexible as well. Let's say somebody cancels today on another detailer. What do you do? Uh, we would call his next uh, client that is up to see if we could show up earlier. And then it just gives us a little bit more time if, if they are available. Um, it gives us a little bit more time to try to find another customer for the ending of his day. How do you make sure they're providing the same quality or great quality as you? Yeah, so um, we have a software where people or employees will take uh, before and after pictures. So we make sure to, you know, um, we always ask to get like the best kind of quality uh, before and after pictures. And then at the same time, we always follow up with our customers uh, just to make sure they're happy and then uh, give us any feedback. You ever have a customer say, hey, the homie Jose right here, I don't like him or he did a bad job? Yeah, yeah, it has happened in the past. And then sometimes customers have like, uh, like the person that comes out, they, they really uh, like their work. So then um, they'll just ask if that person could be the one that comes in in a reoccurring basis. And then we just make it happen. All right, Chris, so you have a lot of employees, but I'm sure you have a lot of customers. And last time we talked a while back, you were charging $60 in maintenance? Yeah, that's right. We were charging $60 for inside and out. Um, and we just allowed people to book whenever they wanted to with that package. And it got to a point pretty much where we had to figure out a way to make the package actually like profitable because it wasn't really working out um, with employees and stuff like that and payroll taxes and insurance. So what we did was starting in the beginning of the year, we made it so people had to book uh, on a reoccurring basis, which is at least once every four weeks. Uh, to be able to get on our gold wash, which actually starts at $74.99 now. And would you say your business is mainly maintenance or new customers? Or I would food? Say, uh -huh. Yeah, I would say it's a mixture of both. Um, for the most part, all the gaps that we have on our schedule are filled in by people who want one wash or detail um, every once in a while. Uh, but the majority of our clientele now is pretty much just all reoccurring. Yeah, so another thing too that uh, helps us stay very organized is that we have a CRM called Field. Um, it tracks uh, the appointments, it makes it so uh, uh, the, our customers have the availability to book online. They could also download our app in the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store. And the app does everything for customer relations, which is the booking process. Um, it gives the customer the availability to track us when we're on our way to the wash. Um, it gives notifications um, 48 hours in advance that we're showing up. 
um, which gives them the availability to reschedule if they wanted to and then gives us time to find another client as well. It asks for feedback at the end of the washes and then it also manages my guys schedule. All my guys have like their independent schedule that they have to look at. They don't have to look at anybody else's schedule where they're like confused where they're going and stuff like that. Everything specific to them. It also takes payments. Um, we It's integrated through whatever payment software that you want which we use Square. Uh, but yeah. And if you detailers are interested on it uh it makes your life a million times uh, easier you can check the description below all right chris so there's a lot of detailers out there that want to grow a team what's some advice you have for them to get their first team member honestly i, I would just say to uh, make sure you hire very carefully uh, the first couple employees are very very vital to a company uh, especially like uh, customer service wise, how much they're willing to listen in, uh, in the sense of training, uh, the, the processes that you want to go through. You just have to make sure they copy, pretty much copy and paste exactly what you're doing and then take pride in their work. I would always hire strangers uh, just because you could kind of train them properly and then, you know, there's no, you mess up your family relationships as well. So Chris, you talked about your next move is to get a shop. What makes you want to get a shop instead of growing the mobile side? Yeah, I think I've kind of hit a, a good peak on the mobile side where last year I had four vans. I kept them all busy uh, and I think uh, the real money is made with the shop. Higher detail packages, mainly um, getting into like uh, paint protection film and uh, window tinting and stuff like that. And that's a little update to you guys on uh, where I'm at on my detail business. Uh, feel free to ask me any questions on the description below and follow us if you want to follow me on my journey.